Hi guys, Chris Corey here. This is a video on the best remote for your home theater PC. Um, I've been using home theater PCs for quite a while now, for over six or seven years. And I've been through a, a lot of trial and error with uh, a bunch of remotes. And I've been doing a lot of research online to figure out which remote uh, was best for me. And these are the three absolute best from my opinions and from opinions of those that I read online. And I'm going to start off with the least best uh, up to the best. So in third place, we have the Lenovo Multimedia Remote with Keyboard N5902. The N5902 has a beautiful design. And I must say, out of the three, it looks the best. And it is absolutely gorgeous. The way that you control uh, your mouse is right here. Here's a little touch sensor that you slide across, slide your finger across, and you can control the mouse. And this is one of the knocks I have against this device. The touch sensor is not really that accurate, um, but it's a cool concept. And as you can see, these little notches here basically act as a scroll wheel. So if you're doing web browsing, you want to scroll <clears throat> up and down the page, basically all you have to do is just rub your finger up or down. And, and that's a very cool feature. As you can see, we have the left and the right clicks right here. And it has a full QWERTY keyboard with all your media center controls up top. Um, another knock I have against this keyboard is that there aren't any F keys. And as you know, if you're trying to get into the BIOS, uh, your F keys are, are important. And uh, they, they don't seem to have F keys. And your F keys act for different functions also. But that is, you know, pretty much all I have against it. It is a very, very good looking remote. And here in the back, it accepts AA. I think that's AA batteries. And in all, it is absolutely cool design. Next up, we have the Logitech K400R. And this is a pretty nice design also, but it acts a little different. It acts as your normal uh, keyboard with the trackpad. And this comes in handy in your lap if you're, you're sitting on your couch. Or if you want to put it on a coffee table, you can sit it down and use it. And it is pretty good. It comes in, in second place because there are a lot of keyboards that you can find like this. This is probably one of the cheapest ones. And it has a great price. You can find it at Walmart um, and also Amazon. And I'll probably have links in the description. But it has all the keys that you will ever need. And as you can see, like the other devices, you have your media controls right up here up top. And you do have your F keys and with your function button here. So this is a great mouse and keyboard combination or mouse and well, I'm sorry, keyboard and trackpad combination. And it's absolutely great for HTPC use. Now this is the Sodeco Air Keyboard. And it absolutely, for me, comes in first place because it's so cool and innovative. The way that you control the mouse pointer is to actually move it around in your hands. 
it has gyroscope sensors built in so if you just move it up and down left and right you can move the mouse around it does take some getting used to and I would say it will take two or three days before you can actually master this device because it gets a little cumbersome when you're, you're moving around trying to get it into the right spot but in a few days you will be a master it has a full QWERTY keyboard but it doesn't and this is pretty much my only knock against the device it doesn't have your F keys but everything else is here as you can see your media controls and one more thing it uses batteries pretty quickly so it's good to have some double-a batteries on hand because this thing probably will last you about two weeks at the most before the batteries start going low but that's it guys this is just my video to show you the three best remotes that I have come encounter with and if you find anything better let me know uh, leave a comment and that's it, guys. Thank you.